Hi everyone, welcome to this Noddy Networker quick tip. Today I'm going to be showing you how to control the display of images for lists within a Meridian AppMaker application. We're going to be working with the HP cloud-based Aruba Meridian editor and a sample application. This quick tip will show you how to control whether images are displayed alongside the objects of a list and also how to associate and display an image for the list itself. This is especially useful if you're using nested lists. On the screen, you'll see an example of adding the appropriate graphics to a list to provide a more visually interesting user experience. OK, so we'll start by logging into the cloud-based Meridian editor and opening our sample application. Here's our sample application. We'll be using the preview pane here on the right hand side to show you what the application will look like as we make the changes. OK, so let's select the top option here. And we can see that it's just a simple list of several other options. Again, this time we'll take the last option. And again, we can see another simple list of options, again without any images or icons. Now, if we want to display an icon by each of these list items, then we need to make sure that each and every item on this list has an image associated with it. In this instance, at least one of these items does not have an image associated with it and hence we get no icons displayed for any of the items. Okay so let's check these items to see which of them hasn't got an image associated with them. Let's start at the top so this page is OK. Here's the image associated to this page. Check the next option. Yep, this one's OK. There's an image again. Third option. Yep, there's an image, so no problem so far. And the fourth option. And there's the issue. We have no image associated with the GRE option in the list. So let's simply associate an image with this item. We can click on the image area, select an image, and upload it. Okay, we have an image now for this item. We save it. And now let's go back to our list. And now we can see that all of the items in the list suddenly have their icons displayed. So just to recap, if you want icons displayed on a list, then all of the items on that list must have an image associated with them. Right, let's take a look at our application now. Go back to the start. We select top option again. Here's our list as it was before. We check our more facilities this time. And now we have the images or the icons displayed as expected. Let's back up to the last menu. Now we know from the last example that if we want icons associated to each of these items in this list, then every item in this list must have an image associated with it. However, it's a little bit more complex in this list. Because although all of these options do have images associated with them, this last option 
is in fact not a page but another list it's a nested list let's take a look at this list now we have a bit of a problem unlike the previous pages there's no obvious place to associate an image with this list what we have to do is temporarily change the type of this page from list to an image plus text. Don't worry that you have lost your previous list content. It will return. But for now, we change it to image plus text. We load an image. Image is loaded and we save it. So now we have an image associated to this page. Now we change the page type back to list and you will see your content, previous content, return. However, the image will still be associated with this list. So now we hit save again. And we return to the previous menu. And this time we see that all the options on this list have now displaying their icon and including our list that we've just modified. So let's go back to the start of the application now. And as before, we'll select the top option. This time we get all the icons displayed for all of the list items. And if we go to our more facilities, again, we get all the icons displayed for all the list items. Quick recap. If you want to display images alongside the objects of a list, then you need to make sure that every list item has an image associated with it. And if an item in a list is actually a list itself, a nested list, then you have to temporarily switch the page type from list to text an image, associate an image with the page, save the page, then switch the page type back to list and save again. That concludes this quick tip. Thank you for listening to the Noddy Networker. Bye for now.